Wah, guam, wah, guam, people, them. So, this is the next one of the VMA performances. This is the tribute to 50 years of hip hop. Hip with hip with hip hop. Um, again, if people have been following me for a little while, like, you'll probably see that I'm more, I'm more, I lean more towards vocals than I do emceeing and rapping, whatever. Even though I rate it, like, I've always, and I think actually in one of my first videos, I was talking about going on a bit of a journey with hip hop because I think there's a lot of stuff that I don't. Like, there's a lot of stuff that I do know, but there's a lot of stuff that I don't know. Um, so, um, for example, like Jay-Z's discography, like he's, he's classed as arguably um, one of, the, if not the best rapper of all time. Um, and like, like, there's a lot of songs that I do know, like, but there's probably loads of songs on his albums and stuff that I've got no clue about at all. Um, so I definitely need to delve a bit deeper, but this is a tribute to 50 years of rap and hip hop. Hip -hop. So I kind of want to just, see how they did the tribute to that. I know that LL Cool J is in there and Nicki Minaj is in there. Um, I want to say run DMC, but I don't, I can't remember, but yeah, let's have a look and see what I go on. Grandmaster Flash. Then I tell them cease fire. I'm the AB 700 on them horses. 
when I'm fixing to leave. But I'll f with the sense Christopher Ray. <laughs> Gotta be careful when I dip. It's flip tool in the whip. It's split the switch. Wait, no El Chapo came in the rolls and left low in the towel. I need to rest some more Nicki Minaj. Hey, you can't catch her, you can't stop her. I go by the goons. If you can't beat them, then you pop them. Can't man them, then you mop them. Can't take them, then you drop them. You pop them, cause we pop them right. Yeah! Still hip as hell as well. Cool J. Now, one, two. 50 years of hip hop, it's time for one third of the great group. Yeah, yeah. That yeah, knocked down the walls for all of us. Run DMC. From Run DMC. Bye. And wave them like you just don't care. Hey. 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 Change away. The 
That was quite a celebration, guys. That was quite a celebration. Yo, that... I, I think what that's done for me, looking at how many people were on that stage and how much... Because, I, I, I mean, they could have had even more in there, couldn't they? Do you know what I mean? And, and I know that, that they had a recent... Um, I say recent, in the last six months, there was like a... Again, another R&B hip hop celebration of the last fifty years of, of 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 hip hop, and I'm sure like Snoop and that was on there. I'm sure there were, if I'm remembering correctly. But because in my head, as much as I'm I'm looking at like how many artists are on there, and I guess you know where do you where do you draw the line? But there are so many other artists as well that probably could have been on there too. Um, and I like so I was thinking like Little Kim was where's Little Kim was Foxy Brown, like do you know I mean? Um, but at the same time, like, I think the performance that they put on was so sick. Like, I love that from the OGs from the beginning that slipped then into Nicki Minaj, which just makes me say I really need to watch some more Nicki Minaj because like, it's so, like, it's, it's, again, she's probably like another prince for me. I go away and people will be like spitting their barbs, lines at me, whatever, and I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about, sir. <laughs> so, and I feel like there's there's probably quite a lot of her tunes that I probably could delve into. Um, I just haven't. I don't know. I don't know what it is over the years. I just, I just haven't. Like, apart from like "Moment for Life" is in my head, like, and something about flying away. That's also a, a fly away tune. Um, but aside from that, I don't really know too much about Nicki Minaj. Uh, Little Wayne, I thought he was sick up there as well. Um, it was nice to see people getting their honours. I think, and I think that's the thing I liked about Lil Wayne's bit the most. Um, and obviously, that's that that tune is a tune. Obviously, LL coming out in his spangly spangly, doing his bit ain't changed a jot really. Well, much. Um, I say still hench as hell. Um, and then everybody, well, run the, the third of Run DM, DMC coming out, and then everyone else coming out. And say, like it was just. It was a, it was a, it felt like a really good way to kind of celebrate, and it makes me as someone who isn't like I don't know that much about old school hip hop really. Like I know like the, the tunes I played I knew them, but I really want to know. I want I want, I want like, like delve under like where that came from and what was going on at the time. Like, I just want to like envelop myself a bit more into it. So I think that's one of the things that I definitely will look to do. Um, and like even I, I watched something just the other day about how like um where how the hip hop genre even came to be like just in terms of looping a tune and stuff and like just not letting the the, the song finish and and it's like that like even that I didn't know up until like, like a few weeks ago like so um it's it's mad because as much as I see these artists and stuff and it's like it's something that like I just feel like you should you should just know, but um, it's not something that I've really spent as much time with as much as like my R and B and as I my singers and vocalists and whatever. So anyway, I really enjoyed that. So I'd like to know what other people thought of it too. Um, was there anyone in it that do you think should have been there that wasn't? Do you think actually they represented it really well? Um, just yeah, just know what your thoughts and feedback on that would be, please. If you could let me know in the comments. Um, if you did enjoy this reaction, then do drop me a like and subscribe. That would be amazing. Um, and I also do have a Patreon as well. So if you want to head over there and show any kind of love, I would massively appreciate it. But for now, thank you very much for watching with me. And I hope to see you on the next one. <laughs>